Hello everyone and welcome back to yet again another video on Kyler's Toys, Games, and More. And uh, I know it's been a while since uh, since uh, I did my last review on one of these guys. Uh, but I'm finally back uh, with uh, these uh, PVZ plushies. Um, I, haven't got, I know I haven't gotten some in a while, but that's because uh, I got my order cancelled uh, when uh, I ordered them on AliExpress or AliExpress, uh, so that, that took a while. It was supposed to ship, but um, yeah, and then it didn't, so I just, I ordered them off of Amazon, so yeah. Um, as you can see, um, I have a new setup background here, in the background there, Minecraft poster, Mario poster, 3D World poster, Super Mario poster, Smash Bros. Ultimate poster, Zelda poster, and of course my pop collection right there. And then up there, the Bowser's Fury poster, and then the Super Mario World poster over there. Um, but yeah, enough talking about that. Let's just get on with the video. Um, but I know it's been a while since we actually finally got some PVZ plush packages and stuff in, um, but yeah, it's, it's because they, my order got cancelled on, um, on, uh, it, my, it's because my order got cancelled on the, uh, AliExpress or Ally Express, so that's, that's why, uh, yeah, I didn't get some in a while. Uh, I'm supposed to get all of these that I have now. I was supposed to get a couple zombies as well, but, you know, I figured, eh, I already have enough zombies, so why not? I'm, I'm just gonna not get those. And uh, it was also be extra, some, some extra money, so, yeah. I used uh, Amazon stuff, Amazon cards and stuff to get them, and my spending money. So, yeah. Um, we're finally back with, uh, some more PVZ plushies, um, and, yeah, so I was hoping to get them from AliExpress or AliExpress, but that, uh, that took, that took way too long, so I just ordered them from off of Amazon, so let's get right into the review. This came in, this pea shooter, this, this guy, came in, like, um, about a week ago. Um, he, uh... He, he... I think, personally, I think he looks pretty accurate to the game. I don't see anything wrong with him. He does stand up. See? Even on a bed he stands up, which is not common for a plushie. Um, I also got the suction cup thing on, on him, but that's pretty common with these guys. They tend to come with suction cup things on them. But yeah, I don't really see anything wrong with him, aside from, you know, his floppy... His stem wanting to flop down a little bit, but, but that's because he came in a package, you know? He didn't come in retail stores and stuff. But I guess if he could try hard enough, then he could just, uh reconfigure his stem a little bit, but yeah, there we go. Um, I don't really see anything wrong with him, so let's just move on to the next plush. And of course, we can't have Pea Shooter without, uh, well, yeah, I got that guy, like, a week ago, and so I already opened him up, and I didn't open him up with these guys, so, and he didn't come with these guys, because it was from a different, uh, retailer, um, but yeah, of course, let's go to the next, uh, next, uh, plant you get in the game. One of the, mo the most important plants you get in the game. The sunflower. I, again, don't really see anything wrong with her. She does look very accurate to the game. Um... I, yeah, I d I'm not recording this on my phone, so I can't, you know, edit the video, but, you know, um, she does look very accurate to the game, one of the most important plants, 
um, because she produces sun. And sun producers are very important. Because if you didn't have sun, then you wouldn't have any plants to put out. And if you didn't have any plants to put out, then you would have the zombies eat the brain. So, yeah. Anyways, um, I don't really see anything wrong with that. this plush. She is pretty cute. Sunflower is always really cute. She does stand up. I love the bases of these plants because they can stand up on a bed. Like so. As long as they don't flop over. So, it, you could do that. But, uh, they don't really hang up very well, I don't think. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I'd have to try. Yeah, I'm trying on the computer. Oh, never mind, they do. Okay. <laughs> and now it's a little... Okay, there we go. Yeah, I can't hang up on the computer, though. On uh, the camera, though. But, uh, here's Sunflower. Uh, there is a different variation of the Sunflower plush, but I didn't get it because it was a little more expensive, and it's not really worth getting two Sunflowers. I, I, I like the, uh, the second Sunflower better, the other Sunflower plush better, but I didn't get it because it was more expensive, and it would be more costly, so... You know, and the petals on it were more better, more better quality, but like this one isn't. It, it's still good. This one's still good. But the petals do bend down a lot. So, yeah, next plush. Uh, I'm doing any of these in order, by the way, the way you get them. Next plush we have Walnut, which he is a very, very simple character. Very simple character. Doesn't have much wrong with him. I don't see anything wrong with him. So that's the side view of him. Other side view of him. And look, you can even bowl with him. even go walnut bowling. So yeah, I think now that I have uh, my main plushies, I will be able to start the um, the uh, plush, the PVZ plush series in the spring. By the way, um, I have two more Chaos Emeralds to go, by the way. That's why I have been holding off the um, Sonic Plush theories, but you know, um, but the, let's not worry about worry about that yet. Um, but like that's why I'm putting it off for so such a long time. But yeah, Walnut looks pretty accurate to the game, and uh, yeah, I like his cracks. I like his cracks right here. It looks it make it just makes him look even more accurate to a Walnut. <laughs> so yeah, go all the way over there. Bye bye. All right. Now, I believe the next one yet is uh, Cherry Bomb. Now, uh, he he does have some problems with him. This this guy does have a little bit of some problems with him. Um, he doesn't really have, he doesn't really have, he has some yellow eyes, and I don't think he has yellow eyes in the game. Oh, look at this! The stems are bendable, though. That's, that's good, that's cool, that's cool, that's all cool, oh, that's all cool. That's all cool with me. But, uh, yeah, the cherry bombs don't look as accurate as they do in the game. Uh-uh. I would, I would show a picture of it. Cherry bomb. So. And they do tend to bend. So, let's see. Cherry bomb.
Well, let's see. Um. So let's see. Um, they do have yellow eyes. Okay. Uh, let's see. Display capture. And put this. So this is what he looks like in the game. Um. You know what? Now that I look at him, he doesn't look as bad as I, as I thought. He kind of looks more like this, I guess. I don't know. But... He doesn't look uh, uh, like this. He doesn't look like that. There is one that does look like this, though. Cherry Bomb Plush. That. This right here. This right here and this right here. But this is what the original does look like. That's what the original looked like. Which, uh, he looks more like, uh, this guy. He looks more like that guy. See? He looks more like that guy, kinda. But there is also this one, which is obviously PBZ2. But then there's Apple Bomb! Which is it, totally inaccurate and not even a plush. Or not even a guy, not even a, you know, you know what I'm saying. But he's not even, you know, accurate to the game. So, yeah, that's Cherry Bomb right there. Um, but you know, the more that I look at him, he, I kind of get more like, hey, he's okay. But he doesn't look as accurate as he does in the game. But the, the, Stems are bendable, though. Come on, buddy. Stop hiding. Stop hiding your face. Stop hiding your face, Cherry Bomb. There you go. So, but he does look kinda accurate, but not. I don't know. Like, at the same time, he's good and not good at the same time. His face is kinda eh. First kind of mistake plush we have, but it still looks good. Okay. Um. Now, if we're talking about PVZ2, then it would be. Then it would be uh, this guy. Then it would be this guy. If we're talking about PVZ2, after those guys, it would be this guy, Cabbage. But we're going to do one order, so he's going to do that. And oh boy. Oh boy. Here comes our first really bad plush. Oh boy, look at this guy. Look at this dude. The Chomper. Now, why the heck does he have eyes? Why the heck does he have eyes? I have no idea. Like, it's so hard to find the new one nowadays. Or the old one nowadays. With the spots on him. But, I don't think I've ever seen a uh, Chomper that <laughs> looks like this. I don't think I've ever seen a chomper that looks like this. So, buddy, I'm sorry to say this, but you're really bad. 
Yeah, I know. When has the Chomper plan ever looked like this? I don't know. Like, when has it ever had a face? Cover this up. Cover this up. And it actually kind of looks like Chomper. But... Uh, just, just... Eh, no. You can, you can go in the trash pile. I'm kidding, we're gonna keep them. And then we have... Snoopy. Now, she has a little bent stuff, but she still looks good. I don't know, is this... Is Snowpea he or she? Let's see. Snowpea Shooter. Snowpea Shooter. Let's see, is Snowpea Shooter a boy or a girl? Shooter, boy or girl? I don't know if Snow Pea Shooter is a boy or a girl. What does this look like to you? Because I don't. Okay, Snow Pea Shooter is a he. Okay. Snow Pea Shooter is a he. So, Snow Pea Shooter is a he, officially. They called Snow Pea Shooter a he, so. Yeah. Looks pretty accurate to the game. If you do a side view like that. The, the head is kind of fat, but we can fix that. There we go. Yeah, there we go. So, Snow Pea Shooter is a he. And it's basically a Pea Shooter recolor, kind of. But, you know, it's it's a good plush. Now, um... I guess if we weren't going in order of PVZ1, then after... Um... After Potato Mine, which we have, uh, it would be... Uh, after, well, after Cherry Bomb, I guess it would be, uh... I guess it would be, uh... Cabbage Pool? This guy, uh, he kinda looks good. Um, he's not as green as I would like him to be, but he's... You know, he, uh, takes on the PVC2 look, I guess. I think he, yeah, I think he takes on the PVC2 look. Um, just don't look at him like that. Um, and try not to configure his lettuce, hair, whatever it is. But, you know, he looks like a good plush overall. And I guess you could use this thing as a slobber. Like, like that. Um, but you know. Overall, a pretty good plush. Um, I just think sometimes maybe it's not reasonable to have, you know, so many of this. But you know, how how else are you gonna do it? 
At least they didn't do it like, uh, you know, like, uh, the, uh, added on to this, like, you know, at least they didn't do that, but it still looks good. Could have been a darker green, but it's still good. Next up we have a bloomerang. How you doing, mate? Crikey. Now, this guy actually looks good. Um, I think he's a bit small. Compared to, uh, you know. I, I think he's a bit small compared to, uh, the... Uh... What's it called? I think he's a bit small compared to the game accurate co counterpart. Um, he can stand up, but I don't like this thing on in the way, so I might cut this off right here. Um, but overall, it's it, like you can do this. fact, actually, uh, it's pretty funny. Um, <laughs> uh, if you throw, if he throws a boomerang at, um, at Jester Zombie, and then Jester Zombie whirls it back at him because it's a project projectile, uh, he just catches it back, so it doesn't hurt him. But, uh, overall, it's a pretty good plush, but it could have been a bigger, you know, bigger, uh, thing, like, taller. Okay, I guess I could that. Let's, let's fix that. Me. Fix. I guess since it's smaller, this could be a female boomerang. But, you know, I don't have a big one, so. One guy we forgot. We forgot Squash, so I'm gonna have to get him soon. I'm gonna have to get Squash soon. her a different color if you do this. Super, it's super soft, soft though. I do like the material they use for the, these PVZ plushies. But, um, Iceberg Lettuce is really cute. Look at her. Look at her. Iceberg Lettuce is probably his, uh, let's see. Iceberg Lettuce is probably, uh, they're probably related. I wouldn't be surprised. So just look at him, and then look at her. Hello. Hello. I, I guess they could be siblings or something like that. Yes, we are. And, uh, yeah. Anyways, look at her. She's super cute. She's super cute. Those big eyes. Turn around, she's just a regular ice lettuce. Then turn around, it's super cute! Oh my gosh. I, I, you're probably the cutest plush I have. Probably the cutest plush I have. <laughs> but they got her blue spot on. Anyways, that is the new plushies I have for PVZ plush. And, uh, yeah. So, since I don't have plush, puff shrooms, an iceberg, uh, or ice, ice shroom, um, let's see. She will be taking the, uh, role of ice shroom. And, let's see, Bloomerang will be taking the place of, uh, the puff shrooms. Uh, uh, 
I really don't know what I can do, what else I can do, but, uh, yeah. But, uh, that's, that's the, uh, pushies, and, um, you will be on the roof level, level. Good luck, buddy. I don't know where I'm gonna get to do a roof level, level, to be honest. I don't know, maybe on the playground over, back down by my, uh, down the street from me. I don't know. Uh, I, I don't know where I would do the roof levels, to be honest, but, you know, it's all good. I'll figure it out, uh, but I have a pool, so, um, we can do pool levels. I'm just not throwing them in the pool, because that's not safe. Apparently, Luigi fan says it's safe. You can just, like, throw them in the pool, put, put them in the water, um, in the tub, and then wait for all the chlorine to get out of it, and then just put them on the ground and stomp on them. And then put a towel under them, and you know, let them air dry. So apparently that's what you have to do, but and I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. I don't want the color to wear. Or, I, I might, I don't know. Depends. I might get a plushie to try it out with first, before confirming. So, yeah. Ugh. Yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed, and, uh, so with that, this video now comes to a close, and I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye, everyone!